What's up, everybody? What it do? What it do, man? I hope everybody had a splendid Memorial Weekend. I know I did until I got back to Dallas. Man, it was kind of wild, y'all. It was kind of wild and all kind of crazy stuff started happening when I got back to Dallas, man. So, you know, took a little, took a little, uh, how can I say it? How, how can I say it? Took a little small, little mini vacation, you might what you say, man. Just to sit back, chill, and relax, you know what I mean? You know, just do some things, you know, and think to myself and, you know, chill with Angie and Brittany, you know, and, you know, go to a few places here and there, you know, visit family, you know, hit a couple little barbecue spots that was going down in the hood, you know, just, you know, just little old bitty stuff here and there, there and here, you know, just to, just to, you know, you know, just to make the day fun, you know, I mean, even though it's, it's a holiday for, you know, a lot of the veterans who, you know, who, um, you know, gave their life, gave their life on the line, you know, so we can all have our freedom, you know, appreciate our, every single last one of them guys right there, man, for dedicating their lives to this, you know, and man, it's just, like I said, y'all, it was a crazy, crazy weekend, man, crazy weekend, man, I end up, so I end up going down to Houston right quick, picking up a friend, you know, bringing him back down here to Dallas, you know, and, um, you know, I get back, I get back down here to Dallas, I go over there to, you know, my other little hood out there in North Dallas, man, and, uh, you know, I'm chilling over there off of Forest Lane, you know, me and my partners, we chilling over there, man, and, uh, you know, next thing you know, next thing you know, man, they having a shootout way out there in the parking lot, y'all, in broad daylight, man, they are having a shootout in broad daylight, man, people getting their windows knocked out, their cars and stuff, you know what I mean, and then at the end, when all the guns smoke, when all the gun smoke went away, come to find out, man, there was a, a pregnant lady, man, who got shot, y'all. She got shot, man, and I'm not for sure if she lost her baby or not, man, but man, y'all, it was a lot, man, it was a lot of blood all over the floor, man, all over the floor. And the lady, and the lady who, who was do, you know, the lady who was doing the recording and everything, you know, I was like, you know, I was like, you know, she's making a video or whatever. So the first thing I said, hey, hey, just make sure you don't put me off in there, man. I do not want to be it. So, you know, she got the feminine stuff. And later I watched the video on my Facebook later, later that night, you know, after I chill, you know, after I chill down and everything. And man, I watched the video, y'all, this whole time, this lady, she was like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I'm like. You mean to tell me you couldn't say nothing else differently in the video besides, oh my God, right? You couldn't say nothing differently. Y'all, man, I was like, no, man, no, no. Come on, man. Come on now. So, as the woman, she was filming, you know, as she was filming and she was about to get ready to go. So, she took the camera and looked upstairs, right? So, I'm upstairs. So she took the camera and looked, up, uh, and looked upstairs. Man, when she did that, man, I just started hiding behind one of my homeboys, man. I was like, dude, stay right here. Don't move, man. Don't move, don't move, don't move. He was like, why, G, what's going on? I was like, man, I'm not trying to be in that video, man. I'm not trying to do that, man, at all. That's just not me. I'm not trying to be in somebody else's video, especially when she can't even talk, right? And she just saying the same thing over and over and over. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. So I was like, man, come on, because she knew what happened, but I didn't really know what had happened, you know what I'm saying? We just came out to to hearing all these gunshots, and it's like, man, are you kidding me? Are you seriously? Serious? Man, it was so many people, man, that got, that ended up getting murdered, man, over the Memorial Weekend, man. It's not even funny, y'all. It's really not, man. So many people lost their lives, man, in this Memorial Weekend, man. You know, uh, had this little Dallas rapper, had this little Dallas rapper named Little Loaded. You know, he's you know he's pretty popular out here in Dallas. You know what I mean? And you know, I mean his stuff is all up on YouTube and uh, Cloud Sound and all that other stuff. You know what I'm saying? You can find him a little bit on Facebook. You know, so uh, I'm not for sure what had happened, but the only thing I do know, man, is that that dude there, man, for some reason I don't know what happened, but. 
he ended up committing suicide, man. And he's like I said, he's he's a popular little rapper, man. He's very popular, man. He did some songs with uh, I think he did a song with King Bond before King Bond got killed in Atlanta. Uh, he did he did some other songs with a couple of big old oh, you know, with a couple of couple of more big artists, you know. And it's just sad. It's just sad that you know it's a tragedy and it's sad how things go these days, man. Where People are getting killed, you know what I'm saying, and they losing their own lives and everything, but you know, I mean, I mean, I mean, it is what it is, man, I mean, it is what it is, we said life is supposed to be fair, you know, but, like I say, back to the fun part, man, but yeah, man, y'all, I had a blast, man, had a blast, man. Man, y'all said I took, uh, took Angie and Brittany over there to, uh, my uncle's house. <clears throat> Cause he never met him before. Man, took those chicks up over there, y'all. Man, dude, my uncle thought my uncle thought one of them was for him. No sir, no sir, it wasn't. I'll be right back. Well, y'all check out what just came and look at that right there. Oh man, y'all know I gotta go check that out. Hmm, what is that right there? I have no idea what that is. But I'm gonna have to go check that out here in just a minute, man. As long as I give me some time to see exactly what that is. That might be something that I might have to end up, I may have to end up keeping just for myself, y'all. Just for myself, man. Yeah, I'm gonna have to check that out for real. Man, y'all, we got a real bad accident right now. We got somebody stuck inside this container. He's got a fucking, he's got a motor sitting on top of him right now. So we're trying to get this damn thing out. Y'all have to excuse me. I'm be running back and forth, man. Oh my God, this is bad. There's the guy right there that got hurt. The one who they're holding up right there in the middle right now. He's the one that had the motor fall on him, y'all. This is bad, man. We don't even know if we don't even know if anything is broken yet. So we're trying to find all that out and see, make sure he's okay. Bad accident, man. Bad. It's very humid out here, man. But yeah, y'all, man. Good thing that guy right there, man, he was okay, man. I mean, right now, my pants are soaking wet, man. Cause I was inside, I was inside with the dude, man. Golly, man. Jesus, man. You got a big four, you got a big 400 pound motor, man. Got you pinned down in between another motor, man. Jesus Christ, man. I don't know what the hell these guys be thinking, man, but you can't do that type of stuff, man. After it finished raining and you got oil all over the place. You know, just thank God, man. Just thank God he's he's okay. You know, man, but man, I had to jump, I had to jump in a whole bunch of water just to get my loader, man. I didn't even care. I did not even care about getting wet at all, man. I'm there to save somebody lives, man. I don't care what my pants look like. Man, that right there, y'all, that right there was dangerous, man. That was super dangerous right there, man. I mean, some I mean that dude could have literally got killed, man. He could have literally got killed behind that right there, man. That's no. It's not it's not how you that that's not how you work that's not how you work things like that, man. You work things, man, to keep y'all uh -oh, to keep you guys safe. Not to, you know what I'm saying, not to try to do anything that's gonna harm anybody, man. I mean, uh I mean, man, I got a strong stomach, but seeing that guy right there pinned like that makes me kind of wonder sometimes, man. That's the reason why I'm always make sure I'm careful with my ground, man, at all times. And I make sure I'm careful around other people because you never know what will happen in the blink of an eye. Anything can break. The seat belt can break. The chain can let go. The, the, the motor hook can let go at any moment of the time. Anything. You don't know. Just playing with your life, man. Don't play with your life. Work smarter, not harder. That is the most, man. Work smarter, not harder. Man. Oh, man, that kind of just freaked me out right there, man. Kind of just freaked me out, man. Y'all know what time it is, man. This bag and tag, baby. Jesus Christ, man. They don't destroy that car, didn't they? Look at it. Golly, man. Yeah, man, so back to the part where I was talking about, man, before the whole accident happened, man, with the guy and everything. So, I take Brittany and Angie over there to my uncle's house, you know what I mean? Because my uncle, he ain't never seen it before, you know, never seen them before. 
So I walk up off in there. Uncle's like, hey, hey, did you bring one of them for me, nephew? I was like, what the hell you talking about, huh? This ain't nothing for you, man. You too old for these right here, man. You too old. It's my man. I ain't never too old for nothing, boy. I don't know what you thinking about. See, you were still sucking your mama nipple when I was out here doing this and that. I was like, damn, mom, do you gotta do me like that? You gotta do me like that? <laughs> oh, man, it was so funny, y'all. So Angie and Brittany, they back there in the background, they they just laughing. They laughing at Unc. Uh, uh, he's already, he's already kind of tipsy as it is now. You know what I mean? Man, I love my uncle to death, man. I love that dude to death, man. Y'all, I love him to death. But he was like, damn, nephew, you bring one of them for me? No, uncle, this ain't for you, man. Both of these are mine, man. They both belong to me. Uncle was like, man, you doing good, man. You doing good. I was like, man, you know me, uncle. You know? You know how I do my thing, man. You already know how I get down. You know, but man. I had to spend the time with fam, had to spend the time with, you know, with everybody, you know, friends and everything. So, yeah, man, it was straight, man. Straight weekend, straight weekend. So, man, I just figured out that I have an MG over there. Uh, I'm not for sure what year it is. I'm really not for sure what year it is. So, I got somebody uh looking it up for me so I can see what year it is and it just came in so it probably will not get crushed right now at this moment but it will be getting crushed sooner or later it will be getting crushed so it will be getting crushed in yeah man but although man although man I had a fun weekend man had a really fun weekend man really really fun weekend like I said, I got to see some of the, got to see some of my crazy family members who I haven't saw in a while. Got to saw some of them guys. You know what I mean? Do a little drinking with them. You know, not no, not no permethazine, man. I'm trying to, I, I, I'm on the quit mode with that right there. I'm on quit mode right there. So you know, like I said, just go up over there. You know, eat some barbecue. You know, couple, you know, take a couple of those shots, whatever here and there, there and here. You know, like I said, just visit fam, man. Just visit fam and just have a good time, man. Just have a good time. That's all I'm. That's, that's all I'm here to do, man. Is to have a good time and show some love to everybody, man. Everybody. What we got there, baby boy. What we got there? What we got there? What we got there, man? What we got there, man. Like I can say, man, it's been a crazy weekend, y'all. Crazy weekend, man. Saw so much stuff. You know what I mean? And hearing gunshots and and pregnant ladies getting shot and. Man, it's just y'all, it just wasn't nothing to play with, man. I mean you could probably find it you could probably find it on the news about what happened over there in North Dallas. You know what I'm saying? You could probably find that. You know, yeah, I mean you can find you can find it on Facebook. You can probably find it on Twitter, Twitch. I mean it's not on none of my pages or anything, you know, but you can find it there. It's somewhere there. But yeah, man, it's just man, just a crazy weekend sometimes, y'all, man. Things get out of hand. But not like that, man. Not like that. Ah! Because the neighbors think I'm selling dope. Ah! Boy, I tell you, man. Love J. Cole music, man. I love his music. Love his music, man. Oh, Jesus Christ. I hate when that happens. Come on, man. Where you going? Bro, like you're trying to flip over to the other way. Y'all already know what time it is. It's bag and tag, man. I get back with y'all later on.